guys, it's Di, and this is our grocery haul for March 30th, and March is over, another month gone. It's crazy how quickly time is going. But anyhow, it was a very fun month, and I'm very much looking forward to VEDA, which is starting soon. Actually, it'll probably be by the time this is edited and uploaded, starting tomorrow or somewhere thereabouts, so that's very exciting. And what is also exciting is it's 60 degrees today in the Chicagoland area, which is fantastic. It's been a long time since I could say that. So the kids are getting ready to wake up from nap. They'll probably actually wake up from nap when I'm doing the grocery haul. And after we get snack, we are going outside. It's been working its way upward from I think it was like 25 or 30 degrees this morning. And it just like rocketed up towards 60 today. So I'm going to do the grocery haul real quickly and show you our meal plan real quick. It's a little bit of an abnormal week, but um, you know, kind of the basic stuff. And I did get a number of frozen things just to kind of like play things by ear. Um, so I'll show you our meal plan real quick and explain those days. So here is our meal plan for the week and hooray, I finally feel like our sign is somewhat accurate. And on Sunday tonight, we're going to be having tacos. I just really wanted tacos, just like regular here's your taco type tacos for whatever reason I wanted to make those so that's what we're having tonight um, tomorrow we're gonna be having sweet and sour chicken with egg rolls on Tuesday we're gonna be having chicken nuggets and crock pot I put chili but I meant uh, macaroni macaroni and cheese <laughs> I'm gonna have to change that anyhow I'm so used to writing chili next to the crock pot but anyhow so chicken nuggets and crock pot macaroni and cheese but it's also a Zumba night so Bella and I are gonna go to Zumba class I have an adult Zumba class she has like a kids Zumba that she's going to go to so it's kind of like everyone's gonna be like eating on the go so that night's a little weird and then Wednesday we're gonna have tortellini with a pesto sauce and some sides on Thursday we're gonna have orange chicken and soup on Friday it's gonna be another like kind of grab dinner on the go to get to things type of night and on Saturday we have dinner plans so that's gonna be another night where we don't have to go by the normal meal plan so all in all um, these are the meals up here. I did get like a frozen pizza to have on hand, um, just like to have an extra meal back. And um, that will be our meal plan for the week. And this is everything for the week. I also forgot to mention it was a very good budget week again. It was about $95 at Target and about $29 at the grocery store. Hello. Hi. Hi. And that is going to help me with grocery haul. Hello. Uh, Natalie. Natalie just got a from nap. Are um, you still sleepy? No. Oh. You want rice cakes? This one. Cake. This one? This one cakes? Natalie likes the rice cakes. So we'll go ahead and show these so we can give them to you. We got one. these rice cakes and ranch because we love them. And also what? Oh, blueberry ones too because I'm sure we'll have to open these. Beep, beep. All right, so here's what's left from the grocery store after Natalie took away the rice cakes. It was about $29 worth of stuff total. So wonton strips, I'm gonna get these for salads and soups, mainly soups. I also got the girls these sun-made mixed fruits to try. Here is the meat that I'm gonna use for the tacos, this 90-10 stuff. If you're not in the US, that just means uh, percentage of fat that's in the meat. That's how you pick out meat here. And then tortellini, these are frozen tortellinis to put in uh, like a basil pesto sauce. I got this chicken gumbo from Progresso. It looked pretty good. Also frozen yogurt and strawberry for my husband. Some drinking water for him to take to work. And then also these Pagoda Express egg rolls. And then all the rest of the stuff was at Target. The food was about $95 and then I checked out the household stuff separately which I believe was around 70-ish dollars. And so this is the sharp cheddar cheese that I got to make the mac and cheese in the crock pot. I also got some of this ready rice in original, just to put underneath crock pot dishes and that sort of thing. Um, there's the taco seasoning mix. This is what I'm gonna use for the tacos tonight. And then some energy peach mango drink for my husband to take to work. Also some glazed chocolate donuts for him to take to work. And then this is my French vanilla coffee that I pretty much drink every morning now. I got this. Uh, orange chicken and sweet and sour chicken and then back here there is two apple juices one I already had to open to give some to Natalie um, Canada dry raisin bran and honeycomb up here I look like I bought out the simply balanced section but here was what was going on on this they had a deal where all these were on sale for 250 and then if you bought four you got one free so I ended up deciding uh, to go ahead and grab these since we're going to be going to parks and things like that more often. And it's getting warmer outside. These are good grab and go type of things. So I got these fruit peels and strawberry. 
I got these fruit twists and strawberry mango. I got these cherry almond Greek yogurt granola bars. I also got the granola bars with ancient grains and blueberry kai. And then I got the fruit bites and pomegranates. So basically I got one of those for free since I bought so many of them. That should last for quite some time. I also got these Annie's Berry Berry Bars. The girls really like those and I already had them in the cart. Then I also got goldfish for Natalie because they're some of her favorites. Yep, there she goes. I have to go open them for her. <laughs> Natalie still does the little hand squish thing when she wants something so cute. Anyhow, I got this taco blend cheese for tacos and other dishes. I got some of this carnation low-fat evaporated milk because the crock pot recipe I found for the mac and cheese called for it. I got two cans of tuna fish and water. Then I had to get a bunch of spices that I was needing, oregano and also basil and some vanilla extract. And then I picked up two of these energy cherry limeade drink things for my husband to take to work. Another rice in the garden vegetable variety, two 2% milks, some bananas, and then also some blackberries and some strawberries and some strawberry and blueberry yogurt. Hi. Here are the elbow little macaroni things Hi. I'm going to use for the mac and cheese, <laughs> almond breeze, and there's the backup pizza. This is a backup meal. You say hi. Oh, you're a mess. You have a messy face. Say hello. 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 Um, <laughs> I want kisses. <laughs> you want kisses? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm sit. All right. Well, come sit next to me. You gonna uh, do the grocery haul with me? Sit. All right. So we're gonna do the grocery haul together. Actually, that was all the groceries. So now I will show you the household stuff that I got at Target. It was about seventy-ish dollars worth of stuff, and I actually got a welcome mat, which I'll insert a clip here. I've already put it outside. Let me see. And here's the doormat that I got that I'm going to go run and put outside real quick. And then household wise, other than the welcome mat, it's just these three sacks right here. I actually got a pretty decent amount of stuff for $70. I got these cosmetic wedges. I use these with my moisturizers and things like that. So I got two of those. I got a real big thing of these cotton rounds. I just buy them in the value packs because I go through them. These are uh, what I use with my toner and that sort of thing. I ended up getting this little travel pack because I thought the little bottles were cute and you can actually use this little container it comes in. It's like a resealable Ziploc and that is TSA safe even though I don't know that I'll put stuff in my carry-on. And then also I got these up and up wipes. I got another little thing of travel little containers. I needed to get some more dishwashing liquid for stuff I need to soak in the sink. I also got this little, um, it's like a coupon carrier, but I'm going to use it for like on the go, either flashcards and stickers or just like travel entertainment stuff. I also picked up some more books. I got one planes and we already have the cars version of the bigger one and then one cars and one planes for the smaller one. So I'll give a planes and a cars one to one girl and then a planes and the bigger cars one to the other girl. I needed to get a grater <laughs> for the cheese so I got that thing. And I also picked up this cute little bag. It was kind of pricey for what it is. It was like $7.99, but I really liked the color, obviously, if you have been watching my other channel. So I went ahead and picked this up just as an extra travel bag. And then I also needed to get some 9-volt batteries for my husband. I don't know what he needs them for. And then I got another set of hair bands for the girls. These are the hair bands that we use. I got, I couldn't remember when I got the travel things, if I got them like a little travel thing. So I picked this up for them. I got another thing of travel wipes because you can never have too many travel wipes. And I got the cats some tuna treats. Alright, so this is our Target and grocery haul for the day. Mom. And that is it for our grocery haul today. So Mom. hopefully you guys enjoyed Mom. watching our grocery haul. We pretty much have just been eating our way through it as we're going. But we will see you tomorrow for a VEDA video. I'm very excited. And every day thereafter for a month. So thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye. Yes. Say bye-bye. Bye. Say see you soon. See you Isabella. Oh, Isabella's still asleep. <laughs> Say bye-bye.